Hello and welcome. We are looking at the 6x8 time signature here. When we have the 6x8 time signature, we have two alternatives, either counting 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, or we can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, making sure that we stress the number 4. Okay, so we have in the 6x8, we have two blocks this one here and this one here and then that can be presented in different ways that we're going to see in the uh, in, in the future exercises for example here we are keeping that separation so what we're going to be reading here is one two three one two three one two three one two three let's look at the two first bars here and how you I read it that would be one two three one two three one two three one two three let's read the whole exercise to understand how this six by eight works In this second exercise, we're looking at this particular case. We're still keeping the two blocks. In this case, we're going to read so that will be one, two, three, one, two, three. Now, if we read the two first bars, that will sound something like this. Let's read the whole exercise. Okay, have you noticed this bit here? In this case, we are counting one, two, three, and we hit in one and two, but not in three. Sometimes you'll find these mm, dot minims here. In this case, that is like adding two dot crutches together. That will be the uh, the length of this is going to be six bits. So in this case, we will see one, two, three, four, five, six, or one, two, three, one, two, three. Hammering the um, note only once. In the third exercise, we are looking at the introduction of semiquavers or sixteenth notes in between, for example, here. So here we read, as you know, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Another case is this one in which we read one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. Let's read it together.
to 3. Now in this last exercise we are looking at this particular cell here which is sometimes more difficult to read and we also going to be looking at this one okay when you see that particular set of notes these three notes what we do is this so the whole bar here would sound something like let's repeat that one once more another one way uh, might find some problem is on this one here that would sound something like this once again let's read the whole exercise 